Hello students how are you all i hope you all are fine today we'll see standard 7th and subject science in the chapter number 17 chapter name is forest our lifeline main one choose the correct alternative from those given below each question and write its index letter alphabet in the box provided against each question one mark each number one which of the following is a wild animal a cat b bear c snake and d pigeon answer is option b bear now see the number 2 which of the following is not a forest product a herbs b gum d uh, c resin and d plastic answer is option d plastic it's not a forest product number 3 what are the microorganisms which convert the dead plants and animal tissues into dark colored humus called a parasite b decomposers c scavengers and d herbivores answer is option b decompose number 4 how many percentage of area is under forest cover of total area in india a 75% b 50% c 21% d 10% answer is option c 21% which of the following is an animal product a gum b rubber c herb and d honey answer is option d honey is an animal product number 6 which of the following is not a forest forest product a gum b plywood c ceiling wax and d kerosene option d kerosene is not a forest product now see the number 7 which of the following statement is not correct a forest protect the soil from erosion b plants and animals in a forest are not dependent on one another c forest influence the climate and water cycle d soil helps forest to grow and regenerate answer is option b plants and animals in a forest are not dependent on one another number 8 microorganisms act upon the dead plants to produce blanks a sand b mushroom c humus and d wood answer is option c humus now see the main two filling in the blanks one mark each number 1 herbal banishings are blanks product its the answer is the forest product now see the number 2 the branchy part of a tree above the stem is known as the blanks of the tree answer is the crown of the tree Number three, blanks form the top layer in the different horizontal layers created by crowns in the forest. Answer is, giant and the tall tree form the top layer in the different horizontal layers created by crowns in the forest. Number four, the branches of the tall trees look like a roof cover the other plants in the forest. This is called a canopy. Now see the number five. The insects, butterflies, honeybees, and birds help flowering plants in pollination. Now see the next page. See the number six. A forest is a purifier of blanks and blanks. Answer is air and water. Number seven. Herbs form the blanks layer in the forest. Answer is the lowest layer in the forest. Number eight. The decaying leaves and animal droppings in a forest enrich the blanks, soils and humus. Now see the main three. Answer the following questions in one word, one mark each. Number one. State any three names of forest wild trees. Answer is sal, teak and simal. Number two. State any three names of forest wild animals. Answer is boar, bison, and jackals. Number three, which requirements are fulfilled by the forest to people inhabiting therein? Answer is food, water, shelter, and medicine. Number four, give any three names of animals feed on dead animals. Answer is vulture, crow, and jackal. Number five, give two examples of decomposers. Answer is certain fungi and bacteria. Question number six. How can forest officers recognize the presence of wild animals in the forest? Answer is droppings and footprints. See the main four. Mark the following statements with a right if a true and with a wrong mark if a false in the box given against it each. One mark each. Number one. No other trees are grown under the tall trees in the forest. It's a false. Number two. Only one type of trees are grown in each forest. It's a wrong false. Number three, 
the decaying matter is generally warm and moist it's a true right number 4 all animals whether the herbivores or carnivores ultimately depend on plants it's a true right number 5 fungi and microorganisms do not convert dead plants into humus it's a wrong false number 6 people inhabiting in the forest are not aware of herbal medicines it's a wrong false number 7 the wide variety of animals helps the forest to regenerate and grow it's a true right number 8 decomposers help to provide nutrition supply to the trees of forests it's a true right now see the main five answer the following questions in one sentence one mark each question number 1 which animals lives in the deeper area of the forest answer is animals like boar bison jackals porcupine elephants live in the deeper areas of the forest question number 2 why had some monkeys jumped higher up on the trees in the presence of children answer is due to unnecessary noise or other disturbance in peace of forest monkeys jump higher upon the trees to give warning call to alert other animals now see the next why did professor ahmed tell children that they would they should not go deep into the forest answer is professor ahmed tell children that they should not go deep into the forest because there are many animals in the forest number 4 which trees are seen in the forest answer is sal teak simal shisham neem palash fig khair amla bamboo kanchar etc question number 5 which different plants constitute different horizontal layers created by crowns of different types and size in the forest answer is in the forest crowns created different horizontal layers among which giant and tall trees constituted the top layer followed by shrubs and top tall grasses and herbs formed by the lowest layer see the question number 6 How is the floor of the forest? Answer is the floor of the forest is covered with a layer of dead and decaying leaves, fruits, seeds, twigs, and small herbs. Question number seven: How are the dense bushes, bushes, and the tall grass useful to the deer in the forest? Answer is the dense bushes and the tall grass provide food, shelter, and protect the deer from carnivores. See the question number eight. What is the different horizontal layers created by different types and size crowns of trees in the forest call? Answer is the different horizontal layers created by different types and size crowns of trees is called understories. On what do certain fungi and microorganisms feed upon? Answer is certain fungi and microorganisms feed upon the dead plants. and animal tissues question number 10 state any five products we get from forest answer is wood medicine gum resin and ketchup now we will see the main six in the next video part 2 stay safe stay healthy okay bye